It's just about 10 o'clock and we've pretty much done everything. Welcome to Hollywood Studios. I'm gonna try to make this quick before the aliens ride behind me starts up again. We are in Toy Story Land um, and no, Kim has not disappeared. She is in that line back there waiting to get on Slinky Dog, which I'll show you guys when it goes by. And um, yeah, we're just gonna have a blast. We're here really early and exhausted because somebody's alarm set up, went off at 5.30 and woke us up. We're not happy about. It's very, very hot. It's like 90 degrees already, um, but the humidity is supposed to go down later, so that is fantastic. But the ride is starting up again, so I'm gonna let you guys go and I'll check in with you a little bit later. I'm just gonna sit and relax. <laughs> So the whole concept of this Toy Story Land is that you're supposed to be really teeny tiny, like even tinier than Woody, and then, so that means everything is oversized, all the toys and everything. This is Woody's lunchbox behind me, which is not open yet, but it's just like quick snacks and stuff we've eaten there. It's pretty good. Um, but we're going to the new Rodeo Roundup or Roundup Rodeo, I'm not sure which way it's around today, so. It's just about 10 o'clock and we've pretty much done everything. We've done all of Toy Story Land and all of the other rides. Um, we still haven't done Galaxy's Edge yet, but we might do that later. I'm really trying not to talk too loud and disturb people, but I'm really kicking myself for not bringing my little microphone because there's music everywhere and I don't want to get copyrighted. So, see that tower behind me? Kim is the nut job who is going, currently going on that. Hollywood, 1939. Amid the glitz and the glitter of a bustling young movie town at the height of its golden age, the Hollywood Tower Hotel was a star in its own right, a beacon for the show business elite. Now, something is about to happen that will change all that. This, as you may recognize, is a maintenance service elevator, still in operation, waiting for you. We invite you, if you dare, to step aboard, because in tonight's episode, you are the star. And then we're going to head over and see the Lightning, Lightning McQueen show, so we're just having a leisurely day.
ballroom with no balls. Finally, they're opening up the gate. Wind chimes? What is going on? Well, it's getting cold in here, and that can only mean one thing. Frozen sing-along was a blast, but Elsa made it snow on us, and I didn't appreciate that. Um, good news is, with that snow, I don't have to shower. <laughs> and now we're headed over to um, Roundup Rodeo, Rodeo Roundup, whichever the heck way you say it, for lunch. It's a barbecue place in Toy Story. <gasps> Daisy! Even the bathrooms are on theme, guys. This is what we like about Disney. Totally immersive experience. Love it. Let's go eat. We took our break, we had some caffeine, we got changed into tank tops and Kim's lovely ears. Gonna go see my man. <laughs> and we're headed back to Hollywood Studios, so. And Rise is back open. We had a uh, lightning lane for 145 and it went down, but they, when that happens, they'll extend the lightning lane and give you the rest of the day, so. Ah, we still need to go on it because it's back up at night, which is going to be nice. We're nearing 6 o'clock, so we only have a couple of hours to get the rest of the stuff done before Fantasmic. But it's been a good day, and it's been a hot one, but it's been a good day. And then that'll be it for Hollywood Studios. Okay, Rise of the Resistance is done. We've met Mickey and Minnie, and Kim is ecstatic because it was Sorcerer Mickey, which is her favorite. She's headed off to try to get on Millennium Falcon because she hasn't been able to do it. I'm headed towards where we need to go see Fantasmic, and I'm going to wait for her there. Um, it's still pretty muggy out, but it not nearly as bad as earlier, so... We changed into tank tops, so it's, it's it's really helping. But once Fantasmic is over, we're out of here and we're sleeping in tomorrow because it's our off day. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. I'll still show you guys Fantasmic, but I just wanna say goodnight now in case I get back to the room and just pass out. So I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. If you did, remember, give it a big thumbs up. And if you have not subscribed already, make sure you hit subscribe, hit that notification bell. So many more vlogs in Disney World to come and some other fun things after that. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye.
你。